welcome everybody back to MGM Chassis for the first episode in 2022 of MGM Live. Happy New Year to everybody. Uh, here with Paul and April, I'm Keith Champagne. Uh, first show we've had in about a month and a half or so. Uh, so good to be back with you. Uh, I'm going to be talking about the last couple races here in Florida over the past week. Of course, there was the big WKA championships for the sprint, the dirt, and the road racing. A lot of MGM chassis in action on the road racing track as well as the Manufacturers Cup at the sprint track. I'll be talking about all of them and the results down there. And then after that, a bunch of drivers went over to Jacksonville, about 90 miles north of Daytona for the CKNA Winter Nationals, their first ever Winter Nationals at Jacksonville. And uh, they had a good crowd there, I think uh, about 160 entries, something like that. And uh, of course, a bunch of MGMs were in action in the juniors and the seniors at Jacksonville. And uh, we'll be talking about all them and be switching it over here to Mr. Paul and Ms. April. Go to the triple scroll. Oh, triple scroll. What's scroll. up, guys? Hello, Welcome back. everybody. Welcome back. Welcome hey, bro, back. bro. We got bro, bro on there tonight. Oh, bro, bro. Well, welcome back. <laughs> No, we, and that's uh, not very nice. We haven't been doing this in a while, <laughs> but we promise that we are going to be back and we are going to be hitting yeah, yeah. it hard. We've uh, just had some downtime and uh, not much to talk about, but I don't think we're going to run out of stuff to talk about uh, the way this year is already uh, starting out. Right. It's going to be a busy, busy year. Yeah. 2022. Plenty of things to talk about. Plenty of things to build. <laughs> Lots of new customers. Lots of new customers. Lots of new customers. Yes. We got uh, 16 go-karts sitting over there ready to build. So... Uh, a pile. Things, things are pretty good. Yes, they and, are. Uh, April's been reorganizing the shop and doing a little painting. <laughs> Keith, you could probably cut off the air compressor if you want to, but you don't have to. Um, Keith probably doesn't know how. But I know uh, we've had some races coming up here uh, lately. We've had Jacksonville. We had a heck of a show at Daytona. Jacksonville was probably one of the better shows that they've had in a while. Uh, run it backwards, so that was really, yeah, that was really cool. cool. Different little okay. yeah a little difference to uh a little different to drive and maneuver i think setup was a little mm -hmm. bit different gear was definitely uh a lot different so it was uh it was it was exciting uh mm -hmm. exciting jacksonville's week. Been getting good crowds at their local race so jacksonville has just been great so it's, it's been good for us too so thankfully and hope everybody had a good christmas had a good holiday and uh we're gonna talk about some results here with april yeah yeah well let's first uh i guess start with daytona because that was uh, daytona. right after christmas God, that um, was an awesome video game <laughs> um i have uh stuff from the man i have some results from the man cup side uh where we had a couple uh, new customers making their uh, debut on their MGM espionages. Uh, Indy Reagan and Ava Hansen from Wisconsin making the, making the I don't trip. know how far of a drive uh, that was for dad. Three or four hours, I think. That's it, um, yeah, I'm sure. Uh, it's not that far. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure Tim wasn't tired after that one. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I mean, they did awesome. Uh, Ava and Indy, uh, did some double duty as well, also heading back up north for the 90 miles to Jacksonville, but both bringing in a uh, top 10 for us down there representing at Daytona. We had in the CIK 206 class, uh, the 360 weight, OD Amundsen um, from a Florida resident making the, his actually was a three to four hour trip probably. You look amazing tonight, <laughs> by the way. Uh, thank you. You look gorgeous. Uh, you look better than Keith tonight. Uh, <laughs> Keith, you look good too, little buddy. Look a little rough tonight. <clears throat> you, you mean you look the usual, but you look great. I'm a little tired, and I need my hair cut. Oh, your hair is a little long too. tonight, Keith. It is a little longer than normal. But old Dylan, he did pretty good. He uh, did. He did. Uh, it was cool to see uh, our new, our two new junior drivers. They are going to be fantastic. Right. Uh, right. First time out was uh, pretty good. Amazing, considering we had some. Had some clutch issues and had a couple other issues, but that's a great first start for, mm -hmm, the, for mm -hmm. the, that pair. Of, and Dylan with the top five. So. Yeah, Dylan is always uh, always, always a quick. front runner, so that's uh, good to see him. I know we had another guy. Uh, we also had uh, Richard Dick Timmons uh, making his uh, appearance in the Masters class. Oh, Nitro Dick was making an appearance. He was, he was. Had he a was... crew chief, B-Rad Prizzle. Uh, <laughs> B-Rad Prizzle, uh, our, our favorite little B-Rad. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I was definitely crew chiefing for old Dick down there on the Masters class. He did not run the final um, just because, well. Because they went fishing. 
Oh, they did catch some fish in uh, Lake Lloyd. Yeah. They did a little fishing while they were down there. I think they caught m more fish in Lake Lloyd than we caught at the beach. Yeah, we didn't do too well at the beach. But <laughs> I caught Dick Ren fifth. Dick Ren fifth in one day, and then yep. the next day they uh, actually they heard the, the bite was on at the pond, so they uh, they took off and went to the pier mm -hmm. yeah, to go fishing. The day, I but mm -hmm. um, excellent job for him, first time at I the. Maybe uh, he yeah. Tried to improve on his P5 on day one. He had the Zach Lindell loaner go kart. He so, did. He uh, did. Uh, thank you, Zach, for uh, letting uh, Dick borrow your go kart. <laughs> he was uh, P1 in practice on Friday. So he was uh, rolling. For, he had some speed for the first time, not being there and being an old mm -hmm. dirty dick. He uh, mm -hmm. did all right. Right. His some, uh, like one asphalt race of the year he makes. <laughs> Dick commented on the orange helmet got him on day two. Oh yeah, I don't know who that was. I'm not sure. Yeah. But the crew chief B Rad told him stuck to his guns. Just told him to keep going back out and. Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They did good. He was quick. Yeah. So uh, thanks for representing for us. Yeah. Uh, One quick note here. Now, Dick, Dick. Mm -hmm. I'd say in the last three years, he ran dirt. Mm -hmm. And last year, he ran road race. Mm -hmm. And now this past couple of last week, he ran sprint. He's Probably the, the jack of all trades. He up. is a jack of all dicks, <laughs> for sure. <laughs> for sure. Way to go, little buddy. He, yeah, Dick no, can do it all. He can do it all. No, he's, he's uh, very he's versatile. One of our best friends, so we love him to death. And oh, congrats. Yeah. So oh, I, yeah. know, I know. Uh, I know Big Ed wasn't happy that you ran so good, but <laughs> that's not nice. Well, Big Ed, <laughs> Big Ed thinks he can outrun Dick, so we just might have to have a race off. So uh, congrats to. Uh, Ooh, congrats there we go. Daytona. I like it. I like it. A race off. Congrats to our short track at Daytona. Drivers. Yes, yes. Uh, Paul's got some resort. Uh, uh, I do have results. <laughs> some results for us from uh, the other single side. Single camera. I still get the oh, wife. So <laughs> I, did, I didn't want to make the camera too ugly. So I mean, I still we like had to it. have. Uh, had to have the wife in there. Uh, we had <laughs> Doug Kittleson and John Miller won a pair of races. Uh, they teamed up, did really, really good. I, I mm -hmm. got a couple pictures from John and uh, congrats mm -hmm. to them. Travis and Levi, dad and kid. Yeah, were, uh, father son duo. Yeah. Dad finally getting back in the seat. Yeah. It's awesome yeah. to so, see. So uh, the new go kart did good for uh, Levi, which is great. The, the big stuff and uh, congrats to Travis and Levi. I know uh, I know mom must have been ecstatic. Looks like they had a blast in Florida. Right, right. So they and then uh, Levi <clears throat> set a uh, track record at uh, Fast Times, I believe, yeah. yesterday. Yeah, so yeah. good. Yeah, it was good to see that mm -hmm. for them. Uh, Mark McNaught was in action. Uh, mm -hmm. Mark actually ordered a new road race cart today, so uh, mm -hmm. we'll be talking about our new uh, oh, yeah. MGM Sorry. Mirage here in a bit. Sorry about that one, Zach. He kind of bypassed you. <laughs> uh, no, that's all. These are all CIK first. No, I no, no. These... I mean that, Mark. <laughs> oh. Well, I mean, who do? You... Well, uh, yeah. Anyways, <laughs> Jonathan Tedder uh, ended up winning a race. How about that? Way to go, Tedder. Yeah, that was awesome. That was awesome. Mm -hmm. Good mm -hmm. for good Tedder. Tedder. We, Tedder's feeling better. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. He won the first day in the yeah. animal class. Not, he's Always good to see back Tedder. To, back to almost being 100%. I know he's been doing... Uh, mm -hmm doing some videos and it's good to see that he's up and running in the in the graveyard still the graveyard so that's good tedder uh ben Tom thomason uh-huh thomason i didn't thomason. murder it for once uh, proud big, of you good job big good ben job. was uh in action mm -hmm. uh christopher agna i do it right agna, I agna. i'm not exactly sure but i think it's agna it's chris the man dude I mean, he's, yeah, Chris, uh, he runs good everywhere he goes, so congrats yeah. to him. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that, that he quick. won one day, too, and Joe Alder on an MGM uh, also won the day, 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 day two. two. Yeah. And then our little buddy, Zach Lenzel, uh, piloted, Zachy. piloted a brand-new go-kart. <laughs> um, was an amazing first try at the go-kart, thankfully, uh, super fast through the road course, which is what we expected. That's... Uh, um, the Mirage, right? The Mirage, the new MGM Mirage. The MGM so, uh, Mirage. He was uh, <laughs> second and a half faster than the field in practice. I think uh, the first day he led by a good bit on the first lap and had motor troubles. And the second day he led for a little bit and had motor troubles. <laughs> so uh, I thought that was I know. A I thought that was an MXK chassis once. It was an MXK chassis at once. It was an Invader chassis at once too. <laughs> so, uh, but copyrights kind of expire, Keith. So there's never <laughs> been an MGM Mirage. So no, it's just a name. It's just a name, dude. I mean, one day, <laughs> one day soon, there's going to be another MGM Espionage. You know. Yeah, you or, can't be the first one to ever use espionage either. No, nah, you, you. I'm sure not. I mean, it's just history repeats itself. <laughs> it's know, a that's, word. That's the way the world goes around. So, uh, 
No, uh, congrats to Zach, and thank you for uh, for trying out the new uh, new ride. Being the test dummy. And being the test dummy, <laughs> but hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll get better with that program. Getting thank you, to uh, Kevin, for uh, for the motors. I know uh, we had mm -hmm. a had a little up and down with the motor situation, but Kevin Colborn, thank you very much. Hustler uh, powers. Hustler power was hustling. Well, the hustler <laughs> power even got a decal on the new boat, so that was that was pretty cool. Uh, John Miller, like we said, Doug Kittleson, Kevin Darling, I saw had a <clears throat> had some nose had some body work in the uh, trash can. So oh. he had a, had a flat one accident. So, uh, but Kevin's won some big races for it. So we definitely appreciate what Kevin has done for us. Joel Negus, uh, him and his three three go kart crew, uh, always always fast. And guys never mm -hmm. leave each other. I think he won heavies maybe one day or. His uh, his other buddy won heavy, so uh, congrats to those guys. They Chris were quick. Oh, Blue was uh, Old Blue. Blue was in attendance, so that was cool to see. He, yeah, I saw that. Yeah, he had a video of him uh, him rolling yeah. across the racetrack. So uh, Old Blue lives in South Florida now. So that's, I know that's a little bit of a drive for him now from mm -hmm. uh, Homestead up. <laughs> like we said, uh, congrats to Joe Alder on his yeah. on his win. Congrats to Zach on leading the first lap on the second day. <laughs> Uh, and congrats to uh, Todd Miller and Scott Heath. Uh, they, uh, mm -hmm. John Miller, that's a heck of a team they have to put together there. So look mm -hmm. for them in the future, maybe uh, on uh, on teaming up again in the, <clears throat> in the road race. So uh, congrats to uh, mm -hmm. congrats to Todd Miller on the W and mm -hmm. Daniel Armstrong too. I think was on a go kart of some sort. <laughs> so I'm not sure what he's, he's racing. Driving. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so his, his go kart's purple, so it's it definitely stands out. Oh, yes, yes, so, uh, you can't miss it. Let's give a shout out. All right, shout it out, Bird Cell. To no. uh, Jesse Samples, the old man's getting better. So the old man is getting he's better, quick, and we're getting quick. to that one. <laughs> yeah. God, he's great. <laughs> Take yep. it away, April. From there, we're just going to go 90 miles uh, north to Jacksonville uh, for the CKNA Winter Nationals um, at 103rd Street, Jacksonville. Um, so we had Dylan doing some double duty, also representing for us in the senior medium class, bringing up a top five. Uh, William Lessig in his third senior race, I guess now maybe, mm -hmm. just moving up from juniors um, in the top 15 with uh, Eli Fox, also uh, making an appearance in the 118. He did some double duty himself too, because he did mediums and uh, lights, and ended up with a a fourth. Right? Was it a fourth place in uh, yep. and lights? And uh, Dylan did uh, double duty. Him and Aiden wrapping up the top ten as well. So congratulations to our Florida group, Aiden White, Dylan, and Eli, traveling all the way down from Indiana. I'm sure he wanted a break from the uh, cold weather and the snow. I forgot to mention a couple things. You got. <clears throat> Uh, Levi Stad beat him by point zero zero eight, and uh, Dick Nitro Timmons was on <laughs> a borrowed go kart and borrowed Dwayne Craver horsepower motor. So yes. uh, we mm -hmm. did not let Dick take any of his stuff. No, I mean, he was actually he. Uh, uh, we set the go kart up for him, put the seat in it, and we, yeah, and we just made, we let made him, him take, take uh, Dwayne's yeah. motor and Zach's go kart. <laughs> so. Uh, Sorry, Dick. We love yeah, you. sorry, Dick. But uh, it was good. It was good for you. They're good. Hey, have yeah. fun. That's yeah. what matters. Yeah. Um, in the heavy class, we had old Michael Clark uh, representing for us. Him mm -hmm. and uh, old Big Poppy, his dad, out there on the track uh, with the top five. So congratulations, Michael. Yes. Very cool. Old Chuckles back in the seat again, uh, crew chiefed by his uh, best friend and I guess former employee. I think I heard he got fired again? already. He got um, fired again. Yeah. Oh, uh, Jamie. <laughs> of Jamie Bradford 118 with a top five in the master's class. Congratulations, Chuck. Oh, Jesse Samples, uh, as Bird was talking about, he did some double duty because he did Legends. I can't believe he's doing double duty. Legends like, and Masters and with a top five and a seventh and didn't even run one of the heat races. It's like the Lance Armstrong. So had to start the last. He's getting, he's getting really fast. He's, what do you mean so, getting really fast, dude? He's Dale Earnhardt's if we can, stunt driver. If we can just get, I mean, he is. He's he is he's totally the, he's the great he's the great totally guy. i mean he's a legend he's a he, legend he is a legend i mean i d <clears throat> started from the back and came all the way through the field for a top five and he gives up 30 pounds 
So if yeah. we get we can get if we can get Jesse to not miss his heat races. Thank you, Jorge. Um, and we can get everything tight on the go kart. Uh, he's tough to beat. He's tough to beat. But it was also it was awesome to see Jesse down there rolling. We also had Oran. Uh, I think started the weekend. I don't know if we're allowed to talk about that because his wife doesn't want him to know that he was there. No. Yeah, Ron started the weekend and Are then we? Austin took over. We're yeah. just going to leave it at that. No, Austin was <laughs> racing the whole time. Oh, okay. Sorry. I thought I saw Ron's we name at one point. Ron's. But Austin with the top 15, we also had uh, old Ed Weinstein. He didn't go to Daytona. He went to Jacksonville. Yeah, because he's not allowed to drive that far. Is that why? Uh, yeah, totally. Miles. Yeah, well, the bracelet, mm. his ankle bracelet was <laughs> going crazy. Ed, we didn't know you had an ankle bracelet. That's new. That's new. What did you, uh, what'd you get in trouble for? I can only he imagine. The, he let the dogs out. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. But, uh, oh, Ed, uh, making an appearance. Him and Joey Miller, the, the double zero, or I guess he wasn't the double zero this weekend because he was running the Randy mm. Reap uh, power machine. Uh, he was so in the 6'9". I love you, right? Oh. Sorry, Joey. We love you, Joey. Oh, Joey still got it. But P. Rice didn't have it when he told him to change caster. <laughs> so Joey's blaming it on his crew chief. This one. Um, and uh, Ed, are you coming back to GoPro next month? Are we going to see Ed make an appearance at GoPro again? Ed's, Ed's a driving machine. He wasn't in the way for once. No, I, I didn't know if it's going to get in the way of his, <laughs> his Bradford, wife and I, of his dirt racing. Though, Jamie Bradford, know? I definitely want to talk to you about what you did with your data overlay something. I heard that you were doing some uh, some stuff there. So I would, I'm interested to remind me to tell me about that because I would like to not really learn about it, but I'd like to learn about it <laughs> or let you do it for us. <laughs> We also had Big Poppy though, Tim Clark, uh, with the top three in Legends. Uh, we talked about Jesse Samples doing his double duty. Steve Lofton moving over from Vintage to the 206 side. Pretty exciting to see uh, with a seventh place finish. Awesome to see uh, Steve out there. I hope he had fun. Mm -hmm. um, and old Stevie B, Steve Bushell, also mm. running in the Legends class. But uh, Brucey Bruce. Um, did Brucey Bruce's name's not even on there. Brucey Bruce. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Bruce. I did not mean to. Uh, yeah, your name didn't come up on Race Monitor. Come on. It must it's be under an alias. He must be. He must be. <clears throat> uh, we're going to go with he's this one in ninth place up here. It's a B. Yeah. Nah. <laughs> um, but Stevie B didn't get to finish, though, so I'm not sure he, he came off a little early. Oh, uh, he was sick. They all were sick, actually. That's probably why Bruce wasn't oh, on there. Maybe. Maybe is that why he didn't <clears throat> run the final sick two? Sick and tired of being great. Ooh, I like it. And yeah. then uh, the Wisconsin double trouble group of Ava and Indy. Uh, Indy, I think, won the LCQ, correct? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, pulled out a win. And Ava with a top 10 and the uh, the feature with an eighth place finish. Yeah, did started awesome. fourth uh, amongst uh, all the other MGM she was, lefties. She was, what, second in one place? Yeah, and she got, finished second one of them. So. Got ran over, I think, and taken out. So she had speed. She was class, quick. I mean, she was quick. She was a bunch of good kids. She was quick at both uh, tracks down there in Florida. Jeremiah was. Uh, and Jeremiah Thomas uh, from Memphis. Mm -hmm. Still want to meet him. Haven't gotten to, but he, uh, was that his second race, I guess? Yeah. Cool. After his uh, Tennessee, he races with the TKA group up there mm -hmm. in Tennessee outside of Nashville. Bruce Jones awesome broke. Awesome to see. Baroque. Oh, Sorry, Brucers. Sorry, Brucer. But Brucer has a nice gear hub that we will show on the next show. Uh, yes, yes. It will receive a 50 millimeter axle, small gears, a little gears, a many gears, and a big, big, big gears. Big, big, big gears. Yeah, so look forward to that new product on MGM that <clears throat> everybody will probably have after we start running it. So, hmm. But at least we'll be the first one to have it again. So that'll be cool. <laughs> Oh, well, we also had some uh, the season finished up from 2021, uh, so we had some championship uh, names here in the running. Um, Aiden, Aiden White, he won the championship in light at Bushnell Motorsports Park. Congratulations, Aiden. Mm -hmm. Ethan Hanshaw with a P3 at the Sandy Hook uh, Club Series and a P4 at the Maryland State Series. Tongue, these are a bunch of tongue twisters, actually. Levi Wilbur, um, seventh in the light class for CKNA North and fifth in the mediums. Alan, El Alan Elwood, uh, BKC Senior 206 class, 14th. 
Tommy Slick Harville, uh, third in the OVKA 206 Junior Class. Travis Varney representing for us out west uh, in the CKT uh, Junior Class second and 14th in the Briggs Weekly Series. Old Dylan Amundsen uh, was the SSKC 206 Senior Champion. Uh, Kevin Darling, AKA RA, AKA RA 206 uh, first and the WKA 206 second. Nice. Congratulations there, Kevin. Yeah, well. Eth Sprint car driver. Uh-huh. Ethan Alexander uh, representing for us up north here. We got some Road America drivers. He was first on the weekend series, because they race like every day of the week up there. First in the weekend series and third on the weekday series for the 206 class. Uh, John DeMaster, first in the 206 Masters at Road America. Master. Tanner uh, DeMaster with a sixth place in the 206 Junior. And Emily rounding out the DeMaster family uh, with third place in the World Formula class. That DeMaster family, oh boy. Uh, they're, they're, some tough. Racers. they're tough to beat. They're coming back down for Charlotte? Uh, I believe so. I think Emily is, yeah. Yeah, as a side Tanner there. has a bowling tournament, I think John told me. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. I want John to take some more pictures for me. Oh, sneaky nice. John. Oh, sneaky Johnny. <laughs> uh, Jamie Bradford was uh, first in the. Jamie who? Jamie Radbad Bradford. There you go. Sorry, sorry. Let me correct myself there. Um, was <laughs> was uh, first in the Masters class and second in Super Heavy in the KRA series, um, followed up by Eli Fox in second in the Light class and fourth in CIK. Nice. Congratulations to our KRA racers. Uh, George Wheeler, first uh, in GoPro and the junior class. Connor Yonchuk first in the senior class at GoPro. Katie Yonchuk with a seventh and junior at GoPro. Lauren Brailer uh, with a top five and fourth in the senior class. Oh, Chase Anderson, our MGM factory pilot with a sixth place in the senior class. Him and Cam Burris were fighting it out. I they? know, Cam ended up with uh, seventh. This was his first year in senior. He's our uh, reigning junior 206 champion from Raining last junior. year. Yep, yep. Keeping the streak alive. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Years in a row for junior, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's pretty tough. We uh, had uh, old Steve O. Melvin Godsey um, with third CKNA North, uh, third in the Masters class, and third at the Masters class in the Whiteland uh, series as well. So, congratulations there to our championship i'm sure i, I missed a, a bunch i have a couple but champions who do you have that's uh, I, uh those are the ones that uh, pickle, pickle i was pete, sur submitted I think, <laughs> pickle, pickle pete i think won the maryland state i know he won the local okay uh, cool, sandy cool. hook uh brody kelly won uh one of the series i think it was juniors uh, on the state series awesome casey little man atwood casey atwood was actually an old race car driver so. <laughs> yeah. but brady atwood <laughs> Brady Atwood. And, uh, go for Everham for a season, I think. I'm sure Brody Kellner was in there somewhere. Um, uh, we had his results, which were really kick-ass. He uh, we're, still love that green guy cart. We're, he was up front for sure. And um, then uh, Scuba. I hear Scuba's making a return for ooh. racing again next year. Is that right, Scuba? I hope so. I hope or there's I'm a Scuba Steve. It up, uh, I wish there was a Scuba Steve return. We I know, need, it's been a few years. Him and Trinopole, I mean, they have go-karts. They have all the equipment. They just, like, brand new go-karts at that. Um, but I wish they would make an appearance. We Wait do have some new, we do have some new customers, though, to, I know he's to shout out. Oh, I'm I sure he is. That's why I said that. <laughs> we do have some new customers to shout out, though. Uh, Ava Hansen and Indy Reagan, we talked about them doing some double duty down south for us on their new rides. Uh, Brian Clark ordered a couple new rides out uh, west in Colorado. Cam Burris is getting him a new one, getting mm -hmm. him a new ride. Uh, Caden Everhart, this uh, pretty a blue blue one. yellow one behind us, he's getting him a uh, second one. Uh, John DeMaster did order a new ride. It's I'm not sure who it's necessarily for. I've not gotten the customer's name yet. He ordered it for um, somebody it's up there in shady. somewhere up there in uh, Road America land. Noah Rivers, getting him another one. Trip. Trip Rivers. Big Daddy Trip. Big Daddy. Uh, Parker Mall, getting him a new ride. Mm. Uh, Welcome coming, back. Coming Parker back to Donnie. the dark side. Donnie said he just likes hanging out with oh, us. Oh, we so. like Donnie. <laughs> yeah, he was on a beer roll for a year. Beer, a beer, a, a, a beer roll? Uh huh. 
He's coming back to the dark there. side. He's, he's tried everything. I mean, it's, he's tried a couple of everything. So uh, glad to have him come mm -hmm. back. And George Wheeler uh, is getting him a new ride for next year. Yeah. And then we got our uh, three. Trip Ritter is getting a new ride. Trip Ritter getting him a new one. Mm -hmm. Exciting to see. Mm -hmm. Cool, cool. Uh, and then we have our three Briggs um, championship winners, yep. uh, Ryan Ginsheimer. Is it Ginsheimer? Ginsheimer. Right? I, I mm -hmm. hope I don't, didn't just butcher that, he's, Ryan. He's awesome because he does his own interviews, so that's pretty cool. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh, Kennedy Spear out west. Which is going to be an amazing find for us. Mm -hmm. Her and Ava are coming for some little um, some mm, junior girl yeah. double duty. Well, she might be still cadet, isn't She's she? She's going to be cadets, but She's we're going to have some girls. We're going to have some girls this year under the tent yeah. uh -huh, at the CKNA and sprint. Sprint. Things. He has another question. Who Mike Burtso, please. It's uh, not about Ava's Jesse tuner. Samples. Huh? Who was Ava's tuner? Her dad. Her dad. Yeah. Tim Hansen. Tim Hansen. Yeah. Uh, and then uh, Skylar Dunning in uh, Canada is getting him uh, one as well. That'll be getting shipped out to Briggs oh, and they're Canada. forwarding it over for us. But super exciting to see uh, those new three faces yes. coming over. So it's been good. I mean, mm -hmm. things have been uh, really good for us. We're really fortunate to be able to do this and have fun with it and mm -hmm. make fun of, <laughs> of Ed and everybody else. Um, but on a serious note, we definitely appreciate everything mm -hmm. that everybody has done for us in the past four or five years. I mean, it's, it's April said it the other day on Facebook that, uh, that you know, we're, we're really happy to be on one race team and, and we've got a lot of friends and met a lot of cool people and we get to hang out with Keith all the time and <laughs> we get to hang out with a lot of great different personalities. I know Elmer has been a, has been a great friend to us and, and Donald has really taken care of us and a, a lot of families like that have really stepped up mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. made sure that our dreams come true for us every day. And, I know Hot Dog, he was here last weekend, over the weekend staying. Yeah, and thank you Kraut <laughs> for taking us fishing. Not Crowder. taking us fishing, oh, taking bro, bro. us fishing, bro, bro. So, uh, <laughs> Jane, it, it's uh, it's it's <laughs> things like that that it really made it special for for all of us that's involved in this program. Um, I know we have the summer series that Keith had mentioned. We're gonna do that again this year. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna making a comeback. We're gonna get some. Hopefully, Chris Cirilla is gonna give us a snap your neck clutch again. And, we're gonna get some different <laughs> uh, different sponsors again. So we're gonna have our own series again giveaway. Mm -hmm go-kart stuff really cool trophy uh Briggs and stratton generators and just uh i know jan chuck had said about you know just small people mm -hmm. like that we're gonna all give away little things which will make it really cool and fun and we're gonna try to make it as we'll give uh, back to the, the, yeah give back to y'all that have given to us yeah. because it's it's what it's y'all that's made us the the best team out there in my opinion and only my opinion but <laughs> That's okay because I am biased. Well, it's still a free country. It's still a free country. <laughs> you got to pay taxes. But uh, we have the GoPro race that I know that all the MGM guys are going to hit pretty hard for testing for the Charlotte race. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Coming up, we're going to have the Charlotte test that we'll, uh, we'll put on our private page. We'll post that on our private page. Um, anybody that owns an MGM that's not on our private page, uh, <clears throat> you have to own an MGM, guys. To be on our private page, you can't just take mm -hmm. MGM owners. <clears throat> and if you're not owners group, I think we call MGM it. Card Owners Group. And I, if, you can. I don't believe you can search for it. Though. Yeah, it's a forbidden in the hidden. <laughs> but uh, the, all that information will be coming just up. Send about me a our, message if you uh, need you can add it. I still find it. You just have to be approved to join. Right, right, right. Maybe. But we'll have a. We're going to hit Charlotte pretty he, hard. I think another member has to send you a request. Oh, okay. Regardless of whatever it is, uh, yes. just if you're not, just get, <laughs> get a hold of it's one top of secret. us. So, uh, I mean, I only spent half of my life on Facebook. So I spent half. One, one or two things. But thank or, you again. That's not a good thing either, by the way. <laughs> thank you again to our, our Tennessee folks and uh -huh. Eli and, and Jamie Fox and the Hoods and mm -hmm. all those people up that way and the Boganator. And Bogan says, I heard Dave from OVKA getting a new MGM. Ooh, yeah, well, I hope. I like it. Yeah, uh, I hope. The Lipskis, thank you for your hot dogs and uh huh, uh huh. Jody and, Covington. And Jody, oh my gosh, I love Jody Covington. <laughs> just, uh, this, just, it's a great group, man. Just, <clears throat> just I mean. And next and, year we will be there, uh, Jesse, because Paul, it was killing Paul not being there as well. At where? At the track. Oh yeah, but well, I just, <laughs> I would like to be there to help y'all make the right calls or the wrong calls. 
don't know. All right, Joey. Oh, Jason Burtzo was the, uh, I, I guess, was the Mike tuner. Is. Oh, Jason, I did not know oh, that. Oh, really? Oh, Jason. Oh, gosh. That's a good one, though. I did not oh, know that, gosh. but good to, good to hear. I no, love that's Jason. Good. That's, a, that's who you want. Yeah, he's he's one of the best. He's, yeah, and he's worked he's on one of the best. GMs before, yes. so that's perfect. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. Well, thank you, uh, Jason Birdsell. Yeah. But, uh, Keith, walk us out of here. April, uh, thank you for everything that you do, Keith. And then everybody, we'll see you guys soon. support your local racetrack, and uh, mm -hmm. let's, go, uh, let's go 2022. That's right. We're ready. So what's up next? You got GoPro coming up next, next month, their season opener. Um, don't know the exact date. I know it's in February. The, the Buckeye Bullets. Opening their 12 <laughs> race series. And then about a month later, less than a month later, Cup Carts will be back at Charlotte uh, for their Spring Nationals, their second annual Spring Nationals. Sure, that'll be one of the biggest races of the year. Uh, I'm sure they'll be opening registration and all that here soon uh, for the Charlotte race. And then some road races will start getting uh, get going. Roblin Road will be in action actually the first weekend of March, the same weekend mm. as the Cup Carts race at Charlotte. So have MGMs racing in Georgia and North Carolina that weekend at two national races. And um, Jeff Elwood, I'm glad that you are out of the hospital and feeling better, little buddy. We love you. Yes, definitely good to yeah. see that you're back home. Stay out of the hospital, please. Yes. And everybody mm -hmm. stay out of the hospital mm -hmm. for that matter. You, you too, Jamie Bradford. Uh, we are thinking about you, Mark, as well. Uh, if you're watching tonight, yeah, hope yeah, you're feeling yeah, better. Our prayers to you, Mark, and mm -hmm. uh, prayers to the Earnhardt family this week. They had a mm -hmm. tough week around here, so. It's a tough week in Kannapolis. Pat Collins, we miss you, Big Daddy. We do. And I went up, I was in downtown Kannapolis the other day, and I went up to the Dale Earnhardt statue for the first time. That is quite a statue. It's the first time you've ever been there? First time I'm close to I go by it every day, yeah. dude. I go yeah. by there and kneel and cry a little <laughs> That's bit. Quite a statue. Oh yeah, every time you go to, anytime you go to the Cannonballers, you always got to stop and see Dale too. Yeah, they yeah. Made, made it nice. See, it's working. Tim, mm -hmm. old Tim wants to be in the... In well, there the we go. Yeah. There we go. I will send it to you, Tim. Jason Birdsell now. <laughs> <laughs> Jason Birdsell sat on the pole at Indy one year too, remember? Mm-hmm. He did. Oh, oh, Alex. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Jason Birdsell's been around. Mm hmm So is Mike Birdsell. So is Mike mm -hmm. Birdsell. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Mike, we got to meet up Saturday night. Yeah. Taps taps. Thank you guys. <laughs> uh, have a, here's to a prosperous 2022 and uh, mm -hmm. race on. Yes. We'll see you All guys right. soon. Thanks, everybody. Have a good night. <laughs>